the first time in 728 days, Expeditionary Airfield Systems Technicians maintained the M31 Marine Corps Expeditionary Aircraft Arresting Gear. This maintenance happens every two years, and Marines go more into depth on unfamiliar gear using their training and experience of other equipment they use daily. I think this type of maintenance uh, teaches Marines attention to detail. We see this gear every day, but we don't get this in depth every day. So uh, they get to see more of like the inner workings, and uh, there's a lot of small things that we have to do during this maintenance uh, that if, you, if they went overlooked, you could cause potential loss of human life. The Marines stay on top of this equipment because an aircraft could land and impact the gear at up to 195 miles per hour. Sergeant Gonsolin also says after seeing the hard work he puts into the gear, he gets a big sense of accomplishment knowing he has the potential to save people's lives. Because I've worked with this gear longer than these Marines, I like to show them uh, firsthand, you know, sort of take the reins and, and show them that I can do it as well. Uh, I, I, like to show, I like to lead them by example. Um, as, as an inspector, sometimes it's hard to, to take a step back, but I, I really feel like uh, where I contribute to these Marines or, or how I help them is that I, I show them that I can do everything that I ask them to do. The gear is classified as deployable equipment, therefore making the maintenance pre-deployment training. Reporting from Marine Corps Air Station, Iwakuni, Japan, I'm Marine Corporal Emily Kirk. Thank you.